everyone, and welcome to this episode. I'm gonna be showing you a really simple woodworking project that you can make with just one board. And just to give you full disclosure here, I found this on Etsy, and I did a little bit of research on this one, and it sells a lot. It's very popular, and I honestly was just blown away that people were actually paying for this, because as a woodworker, this is super simple and easy to make, and if you want to know about like everything that I make and how much money this channel makes and what I sell online and how much YouTube makes as a woodworker, uh, every year I release a video where I talk about that. If you wanna see how much money this channel made in 2021, check that video out. I'll put a link to it right here and also in the description below. But today, I'm gonna show you this really easy woodworking project that you can make and sell online. So first, let me grab this board here and I have a pen and I'm gonna illustrate this out for you. And then I'll show you how we're gonna break it down and build it, okay? So what it is, is it's a piece of wood. And I'm just doing some illustration here. I'm doing a little 3D illustration, if you will, give you some perspective view. And it's a pedestal that holds soap. And that's what it is. That's what we're gonna be building. Now you go, what, that's so simple? I showed my wife this because I actually couldn't believe it. And she goes, oh, those are so popular. People buy those all the time. I'm like, it's just a piece of wood that's elevated up. Well, full disclosure, I wanna give the, the maker credit for building this and I'll put a link to their product in the description below. But I'm gonna actually, you know, like all competition and, you know, what not, I'm gonna make mine better and I'm gonna sell it online. So if you wanna see uh, what it looks like and how much I'm selling it for, I'll put that link right here and also in the description below. But if you're interested in making it and selling it online, I welcome the competition. So let's get started and let me show you how to build this. Okay, so the material that you need to build this project is just a one by four. This is actually all we're gonna use to make this. We're gonna make three cuts, and I'm gonna put the information to those cuts and the links right here in the video so you can take a look at that. And the only tool you need is a miter saw. And I mean, if you're really good, you could probably hand saw this. You wouldn't even need this tool, but I would recommend using this because it would just be that much faster. And once we've cut everything, we're gonna move over to my table and we will then start assembling it. Once it's assembled, I'm gonna add a special unique touch to it to make mine different than everyone else's that's on the market because you wanna be competitive. All right, so let me make all these cuts and then we'll move on to assembly. So I've cut all my pieces. You can see there's the top and the two bottom feet or legs or whatever you wanna call them. Now I'm gonna assemble everything using glue. The reason why is I don't want any nail holes or screw holes to be in this project. Now I'm using tight bond super glue with an accelerant. Uh, you don't have to use that. You can actually use wood glue if you want to and clamp everything down and wait for it to dry. However, I'm using this because I can glue everything up in 10 seconds. So that's a really good benefit to using this. So let me glue everything up and then I'll sand it. And then once that's done, I'm gonna move on to adding the finishing touch that I think is gonna make this much more unique than what is currently on the market. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just take this glue and I'm just gonna put a little line right here all the way down and then I'm gonna take the accelerant, spray the corner, and then just quickly apply this. I have about 10 seconds to move it around, and then put the pressure on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. That is secure. All right, so now we're gonna do the other side. Do it the same way. Got my table a little wet there, that's okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. And that is dry. Okay. Okay, so the glue is dried, we're all good to go, and now I'm just gonna give everything a nice good sanding, and then I'll move on to that finishing touch. Okay, 
Sanding's done. Now what I'm gonna do to make this unique is I'm gonna add a 45 degree bevel. Now it's not gonna be a big bevel, it's gonna be a very tiny bevel that's gonna go all the way around. Now I think that'll make this look a little bit more um, clean and elegant. And otherwise it's just really a block of wood stacked on top of a block of wood and people are paying $18 for this, believe it or not. But I'm gonna make mine a little bit nicer and I'm gonna let people customize it and mine will have a nice little bevel on it and I'm gonna charge $15. All right, so let me get my uh, palm router and we'll route a nice 45 degree bevel. All right, so now that everything is routed, it's now time to put our finish on this piece. Now I'm gonna use Early American because that's one of my favorite stains. And then I'm gonna show you what this looks like when it's all done. enjoyed this project and you learned something that you can do with just one piece of wood and you can sell it online. How great is that? Well, if you like this project and you want to see more projects like this, hit that thumbs up button for me. I'd appreciate it. It lets me know that you like this and you want more and also it really helps others find this content. In addition, if you don't want to miss my other videos that I'm going to be coming out with, you know what to do. Hit that subscribe button and ding that bell to get notified. All right, guys, till next time, I'll see you later.